Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Before we jump into things in this video, I just want to say a huge shout out to everybody who subscribed because we are now at 50k on the Toxic Tom channel. You'll love to see it. Next stop is the 100k, so definitely make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. But today, we're going to be taking a look at the new brawler coming into Brawl Stars through a challenge. So this brawler will essentially be free if you are good enough and you can beat the challenge. Obviously, I, I will have a guide out for that. But yeah, Griff is going to be an epic if you cannot... Um, unlock him on the challenge then obviously you're gonna have to unlock him through boxes but griff i don't know i think griff's gonna be pretty strong we're gonna be jumping into some games so once again big shout out to super that for giving me early access to show you guys the new brawlers and the new update um so yeah let's jump into it okay so hopping into the first game here then so obviously we're testing out griff uh starting off with brubal here gonna be trying his first star power but yeah i don't know it definitely feels pretty strong you can get those shots out really quickly looks like we are gonna pick up our super here the super by the way it feels one of the most broken things because you have these five cards that are all dealing damage. Of course, when they return, they can actually deal damage through walls. But if you're standing on somebody, and like obviously all the cards are going to hit then, so it's going to deal a ton of damage like this. Like they're all going to come back if you if you do it well. Obviously, I, that was bad for me because I'm not the best player. Uh, but if you actually can do it good, you can essentially have them standing in front of you. That way, when the cards come back like this, they're going to take pretty much the damage from every single card. And that's going to be a ton of damage. So, I don't know. I definitely feel like this Griff has the potential to be really, really strong. Especially against those tankier brawlers because, like, that's what Griff is going to counter. Uh, tanks mainly. But obviously, you have really good, like, spread damage. Pretty good medium to uh, short range damage. So, yeah, you're going to be pretty good. You don't really need... Looks like they are going to come back still, even if you die. Um, so, yeah, that's also something else to know if you're a slightly uh, noob, I should say, like me. Um, but, yeah. We do use the first lap out here. means we can reload it a little bit quicker. I'm going to push up. I just think you can just do so much damage close range. Obviously, you have those nine shots that are set in, like, there's, like, three different rounds of them. So, like, in three threes. And they each do around, I think it's 314. So it's like 900 kind of per row. And uh, it's, I don't know, it just feels, it feels like a lot of damage. It looks like these bots are going to leave this goal open. We've got a trick shot on the bots, guys. Come on. We're going to spin on them too because, you like, Danny Danny likes to spin on the bots as well. We, we might as well spin, honestly. We're going to get our super off here. That's going to come back. You want to, like, push them so that super kind of does maximum damage. But, yeah, Griff does feel really, really strong to me. Um, It's definitely going to be exciting to see him in game. Looks like the trick shot. The bots are getting... Wary of it. Okay, we need to be careful of that. This is the gadget, by the way. It's going to drop a little bomb, which is going to deal 1,000 damage and also going to destroy um, walls or anything that will be in that area, of course. So, yeah, definitely an okay gadget. It reminds me of... Kind of reminds me of, uh, like, a cross between say uh bells one and then potentially i don't know i don't know what else but just like a bell with like some extra damage like it's pretty similar to a bell in my opinion anyway that's gonna wrap up for the first game let's jump into some more modes and see how good this new brawler is okay so jumping into some heist now we're gonna see how good griff is here but yeah i definitely feel like griff will be good just because of that super i think if you can get on safe and about to do a ton of damage look at these shots by the way just really really solid damage um, but yeah, we're gonna see if we can get on the safe here. See how much damage we can do if we hit all these shots in the super here. Obviously, Griff is meant to really counter tanks, especially with the super. Many people are grouping together, you're gonna be able to get a ton of value from that. It looks like Sprout is just gonna block the mid here. That was definitely a little bit cheeky from our Sprout, but let's uh, push this Sandy here. We're gonna have to get our super back pretty quickly, so shouldn't we be too worried about that? I'm gonna put this gadget down. Kind of missed there. The gadget, as you can see, the explosion like radius is really not that large so you do need to be kind of careful where you use it not that this gadget is like too good i, I honestly feel like this is one of the, the, the like weaker gadgets in the game i just come on i don't know i feel like bells is kind of good you can get some value i don't know about this one though because obviously it's not going to stay like bells are the trap it's going to go so you have to be careful with that I, i'm trying to get used by super on the safe here but they ain't letting me hopefully this bear will help us out here and uh let's see how much this super does then so we're going to shoot it here. It's going to do 2k on the way there. And I don't even... I didn't see how much it did on the way back. Try, I'll try and uh, get the super one again. But I don't know if... I don't know if Heist can be Griff's uh, like best mode. Your reload speed's qu pretty quick. So it can get on safe. I feel like your damage is going to be really good. Like, look at that damage. It's actually really solid. So I don't know. I feel like the damage is pretty good. So if you can get on safe... You must have a lot of damage. Let's see how much we do here. Of course, the Brock's going to take us out as soon as possible. Reload speed, pretty good. Especially with this first star power here. So you can definitely get your shots off quickly. Get off some good damage on the safe. Looks like they're pushing through mid again. 
But we kind of just melt them here. Not going to lie. Going to use that. Kind of reminds me of like a Poco Super. That kind of range. I, I think it's like... I mean, that looks exactly like a Poco Super. That kind of range there. So, uh, yeah. Definitely pretty similar to Poco. If not the exact same. I don't know exactly. But we're going to try and get on the safe here. And see exactly how much damage we can do. We're going to be able to do 2k there. Um, looks like we didn't do too much. Okay, maybe we didn't. Just stack so I didn't really see. But yeah, definitely did a solid amount. I feel like... Definitely have very high DPS. And you kind of counter tank, so... I don't know. I thought Griff's going to be pretty strong, in my opinion. But, uh, the shots as well, because they, the way they spread out, they're not too hard to hit. I don't know. I feel like... I feel like you better hit most of them. It's like a gene shot, but a little... Oh, obviously, harder to hit than a gene shot, because gene shots are very easy to hit. So, uh, yeah. I feel like it's going to be pretty easy to hit your shots. I don't know. I feel like Griff will be pretty strong in heist. Okay, hopping into the next one here. We're jumping into some showdown. Um, but yeah, I was just uh, thinking that I definitely kind of overrated Buzz. Maybe I'm over overrating Griff. But, I don't know. I feel like Buzz has a, has really good potential. I think that at the moment, we're in a really tank-based meta where tanks are so good. So I feel like the um, if Buzz is good, Buzz isn't really the best in tank metas. Because obviously Buzz counters most of the other brawlers and tanks tend to counter Buzz. So I feel like, I don't know. I feel like that's definitely maybe... One of Buzz's, uh, like, worst metas to be in. So, uh, yeah, if it's a different meta, I think Buzz will be a lot better. By the way, how good is this gadget? I just realized if you can use this gadget, um, say you got, like, a Primo or something, just, or, like, a Daryl roll on you, any kind of aggro to try and attack you, you can just use that gadget to kind of force them back, especially in Showdown. You know those teaming Primos, guys? You know them. Uh, but, yeah, you can use your gadget to kind of uh, knock them back. I feel like Griff was designed to counter tanks. I feel like Supercell knew it was going to be a tank meta. Um, or even just counter buzz. And they are like, yep, we're going to make this Brula to counter tanks pretty much as much as possible. But yeah, definitely. Definitely uh, like Griff. Griff, really fun Brula. Really satisfying to play as well. Shot's pretty uh, interesting to hit. Going to try out this new star power once we wrap up this game here. But yeah, Super feels very good as well. Looks like Bot9 is surviving somehow. We're going to use... The gadget here, show you how it's going to be done. Going to break up that wall. I guess it's going to be good and brawlable just to break walls and stuff. <laughs> Looks like that's going to be a weird. Let's jump into one more. Okay, jumping into the next one. So we're going to be testing out Griff's uh, second star power here. So this one basically makes you regen HP even when you're not healing. So you can keep shooting here. Let's take some damage. And uh, yeah, going to show you how this works. So essentially, um, of course, oh, come on, do some damage to me. There we go. We're going to start healing without even healing here. So as you can see, I'm shooting, but we're still healing up. So definitely a nice, I'd say it's a pretty solid star power. Um, but I think the other one is still going to be better, to be honest. Okay, well, that's going to wrap it up for the video. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.